Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 15th, okay? So right around the 15th, we know the timing is fluid. Not every reading is for you. I may not get all the weeklies done. <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying. Uh, yeah. What do we have for a message today? I'm going to get them all done. And they will be for the next, I mean, it just might not be tonight. <laughs> we'll see. You know, I like a clean house. And, you know, I got to be a mother. Two cups reversed. So two of cups reversed. That's a separation of some sort. There could be problems with a partnership here. You know, the two of cups reversed is lack of unity, lack of togetherness, you know, not working well together. They're, they, you know, this is disharmony, a disconnection, a detachment. A separation of some sort. Could be an argument. Could even be a breakup with the two cups reversed. Ooh, now the four of swords is tired. Exhausted. You know, this has reached the end. Somebody may be feeling isolated from a partner. Feeling very alone. Needing to take a break, needing a break. We could definitely have a breakup here or a separation. This is the death of a situation, right? There's pain, there's heartache, there's grieving, there's a lack of communication, there's a lack of, of unity. Knight of Pentacles. Now, this is about being practical. Doing the right thing. The Knight of Pentacles does the right thing in a very practical manner. Doing the responsible thing. Now, the Knight of Pentacles is somebody that, well, this guy has something in their hand, has something in, the, in his hand, his or her hand. Stability. This is somebody that is stable, that is a hard worker. Somebody works really, really hard on their, you know, financial plan, their financial stability. It could be affecting their partnership. This is a hard worker. Oh. Ooh, Knight of Swords and the Seven of Swords. So things happening fast, very, very, very fast. There's, there's, there's some sort of sneaky behavior. Somebody's being very sneaky. It's like they're getting away with something. They think that they're getting away with something. Well, they are. They've done something. I feel like we have somebody here that has done something uh, very, very shady. They may be making a getaway. You know, they may be trying to get away getting away quick. Somebody's trying to get away with something. You know, this is trying to get away with something. It is. This is somebody that is, it feels like they're making a getaway. It's like they're doing something shady and they're getting out of there and they're getting out of there quick. So we got some sort of deception, some sort of lies, sneaky behavior. This is somebody that is very, very sly. They're doing something and they think that they, well, right, right now, as, as, it, as it appears, it appears that they're getting out. They're getting out of a situation. They're, they're getting away with something. Um, they've already done something or they're doing it right now. This is somebody that is very str strategic. This is somebody who puts their plans in action that doesn't have any fear. It's a fearless individual. This person, I don't feel like this person really has a conscience. You know, they're, they're, it's almost like they're doing something they're, or they're taking something that isn't theirs or they're doing something that they shouldn't be doing. This is somebody that is very cunning, very clever. It's almost like they're gloating as well. It's like, ha, 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 ha. You know, but I, I feel like this person, um, 
It fe almost feels like they're 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 in a hurry. They're in a hurry to get to some place with whatever it is that they took. You may have a thief here. I'm I'm not sure if it is a thief, but it could be a thief. You know, the Seven of Swords is is definitely shady, sneaky behavior, acting without conscience, doing something underhandedly. Somebody could also be running away. They could be running away from a situation. Could be even sneaking away. There could be some deception. There could be cheating. There could be lies. Somebody is, is running in a new direction. They are. And they're leaving something behind. And they don't care who they hurt because this guy's got the five swords here. Five of swords, I don't care who I hurt. And this is two. We got somebody here who doesn't care who they hurt as long as they get what they want. So we definitely have a very shady, cunning uh, trickster here who is on a mission. And it feels like they're, they could be, they could, it's interesting because that page of, we have some, this person is loyal. So we have one person that is loyal, that is faithful, that is hardworking, and another one that is not, Okay. And that's why there's an argument or there's incompatibility or a separation. We have somebody here that is hurting over deception, hurting over who, another person who is basically uh, doesn't care if they hurt them, you know, has, has deceived them, cheated on them, lied to them, whatever they did, you know. You know, somebody may be up against, it feels like they could get stopped, you know, because I, I keep, what I just heard was a badge. You know, I looked at that Knight of Pentacles, I heard, I saw a badge, you know, so I don't know if somebody is in a hurry to, to make a getaway and they get stopped because you notice this horse is not moving. It's stopped. This one's in a hurry. They're speeding. They're speeding. They're in a hurry. They get stopped. They're, you know, I'm just saying... There could be somebody that's going to get stopped in their tracks. They think they're getting away with whatever they've been doing. They're not going to get away with it. There is going to be a separation. Hopefully it's not, you know, I mean, this could be, this is the death of a situation or idea. So hopefully it doesn't, you know, I don't know. It could, it could end badly. Um, this person, somebody's not looking where they're going. You know, they're in a hurry. They're on a mission. They're not, this person's not looking where they're going. They, this could be a roadblock. Something in the road. I don't, I don't know where that's coming from, but we got somebody here that's not looking where they're going. Okay, they're in a hurry. They're in a really, really, really big hurry. Now, we also, what I just saw is we have a couple that are not on the same page. They have, a, they have a lot of differences. A lot of differences. This one is spur of the moment, fly by the seat of their pants, you know, very aggressive. This one is quiet and shy. We have black and white. You know, so we have, we, we have a partnership. It's not all... It's not, it's not that easy. There's something going on here. There is something going on. There's probably going to be an argument or a fight. <sighs> Somebody's about to get stopped in their tracks. This person is out of control. Somebody is out of control. They do not care who they hurt. Somebody could even end up in jail. They could end up in prison or in a hospital or worse. Somebody's not looking where they're going. They're looking back at something. It's almost like they run into something because they're not looking where they're going. Ooh. 
Ooh, nine of pentacles reverse. Unstable. And this is mentally unstable. We have somebody here that is definitely mentally, mentally, mentally unstable. Insecure. Not enjoying life. This may have to do with money. It's stealing money. Somebody may be stealing somebody's money. This person does not have a conscience. We could have somebody here that is financially unstable. You know, they don't care who they hurt. They just want something. They need money. Nine of Pentacles reversed. That's a need to take action. There's a need for discipline. Somebody needs to find their discipline to work, to work but they don't want to work. You know, this is a worker. This is somebody who doesn't want to work. That doesn't work or doesn't, I don't know, something about working. And there's a, there's been a, there's been, I feel like there's a, I don't know, maybe it's stealing or thieving or something. We, we also may have somebody here that doesn't really want to be alone They've been feeling alone, they're depressed, whatever. They may be cheating because they're alone, and they could be cheating, could be lies, could be stealing, whatever. I do believe that we have disharmony in a partnership. It is not compatible. There's an argument, there's a fight of some sort that may send somebody off in a hurry. This person is mentally unstable, and they may not be looking where they're going, and they could get in an accident. Okay, there you go, I said it. Anyhow, that could be the case as well. And it could, it could end badly. Hopefully that's not the case. Um, but anyway, there is going to be a separation here be with that, with that, or an argument. If it's not a separation, it's just an argument. Uh, and it, it's, about, it's about deception. Okay, Maybe somebody, I was just going to say been sleeping with somebody. You know, because that's, I just, that's like sleeping and this is cheating. So, you know, that somebody may have not realized that they were going to get caught. They may have made a stupid mistake and, you know, they get caught. End of a relationship. This is, this is, uh, it is, this is relationship problems. We have a partnership that there is deception, okay? The relationship is not on the same page. These two people are opposites. They are complete opposites. But the only reason they're together is because they don't want to be alone. And there's a lot of going behind each other's back. There's sneaky, shady behavior here. <sighs> so anyway, I do believe that we have somebody that is going to be getting out of a situation quick. They may leave very quickly. You know, just as I got to leave, I got to leave. There could be a fight or something or an argument. Um... A conflict. There's probably going to be a conflict within a partnership where somebody decides to leave. And whether they just go for a ride or whatnot, they could just, you know, be like in, in a hurry. They're all pissed off and, you know, they run into something. And then they probably are pissed off. And it's interesting because I said that before I looked down. The Page of Swords in reverse, that is somebody that is pissed off. This is being caught off guard. This is argumentative, hostile. And I was going to say hostile when I was when I was looking at this and then um because of the five five of swords in this guy's hand. The five of swords is a hostile situation. Even though there's two swords here, but the five of swords is a hostile situation. This is hostile as well. There could definitely be a fight here. There could be a fight. And it's it's hostile. This is this is somebody who likes to argue. There there could there's def I feel like for some some somebody there's mental health issues here as well. We have somebody here that has some mental health issues. They may need help. Okay, they may need rehab or something like that, or a hospital or hospitalization. Hospitalization, but you know. It's almost like crazy. 
you know, with this Knight of Swords. Over the loss of a partnership or a relationship or something like that. This is a broken relationship. So this is a dying dream. And doing something shady, don't care who they hurt because they've lost a partner, you know, or a relationship. Or there's an argument and somebody is leaving the relationship. And they don't want to be alone. They don't want to be single. And this is not enjoying life. This is somebody that is very unstable and insecure and doesn't really want to work or doesn't put in effort or something like that. This person may have cheated. You know, they may have done something shady. They got caught, you know, and now they don't have a partner anymore. <laughs> Anyhow, Page of Swords reversed. That is... Uh, unexpected conflict there's gonna be an unexpected conflict somebody's gonna be caught off guard we have an aggressive troublemaker here we do this is an aggressive troublemaker who is mentally unstable okay mentally 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 unstable And they're not happy at all. They're not happy over not being in a relationship or not having a relationship or fighting with a partner or something like that. They may say they need a break. I got to take a break. I got to get out of here. You know what I mean? And, you know, things, things happen when you're pissed. There could also, I, you know, I mentioned the badge earlier. Somebody could get into an argument and the police get called. Somebody gets arrested and they end up in jail. They may have hurt another person because that's the, the Five of Swords and the Seven of Swords is, is hurting other, another person. It is. I don't care who I hurt. Get out of my way. So, you know, and what I, what I, what I wanted to say... And I hope this isn't the case, but right at the beginning, and I've thought a couple times, hit and run. Hit and run. It's come up a couple times, and I haven't said it. So I don't know if this is a hit and run, but I think that I'd just stay home if I was you. Anyhow, um, we do have a separation we do have a separation. We have an argument here in a relationship where somebody has been not telling the truth. They don't care who they hurt. Somebody could be sneaking away as well, like in the middle of the night. I do think there's going to be a conflict. Somebody's going to be caught off guard. There could be a sudden arrival or a sudden departure with the Knight of Swords. We could have somebody here that um, is alone and somebody shows up. This person is on a mission. This is somebody that is on a mission and they don't have any fear. They may have a vendetta. This is a schemer. And this is a planner. So I'm not sure if somebody has planned something. Maybe they've planned to steal something or to do something that is against the law. I feel like this is against the law, whatever it is. I do. I feel like it is against the law. And I think it's because this person is hurting over a partnership that didn't work out. So now they don't care who they hurt. So they might as well. You know, it's that kind of energy. And it's sad. It is sad. Anyhow, um... Somebody is leaving a relationship, okay? Whether they are leaving it in a traditional way or not, they are leaving a relationship. This partnership, this union is ending. It is ending. Woo! 
Four of Wands is an upcoming get-together. There's going to be a get-together. There's going to be a gathering, a celebration of some sort. I wonder, I mean, I don't know if, if somebody is, is, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Somebody could, uh, well, I don't know. But, you know, we definitely have somebody that is separating from a commitment. And there could be an upcoming get-together because of it. Um, there also, it could be um, somebody coming in really, really, really fast. We, we have somebody here that may be independent. They're not looking for a relationship. They don't want a relationship. And they're receiving an opportunity from somebody. This could be somebody that um, is real. This person could be coming out of nowhere. Okay, you could run into this person. You're not looking where you're going. This is another whole, it's a completely different story. You may not be, you may, you may have your arms full. You're, you know, you're not looking where you're going and you run into somebody. There's some sort of running into somebody. Okay, and it leads to a commitment, leads to a marriage. If we have this single person, somebody comes in out of nowhere. Okay, you could meet somebody at a gathering, at a get together, at a party. Um, could be a store because I wanted to say store when I was talking. So I don't know if it's a store. Could also be a funeral. You know, and I hate to say that, but there there could be a funeral here. Um, so I, there is going to be an upcoming get together. There's going to be a celebration. There's going to be uh, an arrival or a departure or both. Okay, that does lead to happiness, okay, because the Four of Wands is happiness. This is like going through a new doorway. Somebody is going through a new doorway. It, it happens very suddenly. It's just, this is like a run-in. We may have somebody here that isn't looking for a relationship, and it just shows up. It shows up out of nowhere. Um, they may have been isolating themselves, healing over a broken heart. This is a broken heart. They aren't looking for a relationship, and boom, here it is. This is the Knight of uh, Swords is a warrior. This is somebody that doesn't have any fear. This is somebody that uh, knows what they want. They have a plan and they're going to take action on their plan. And should anybody try to stop them, they're going to get hurt. Okay, because you can't stop the Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords is somebody that is on a mission. And like I said, should you get in the way, you will get run over. So anyhow, there is a new commitment here. So somebody could be becoming committed to, I don't know, hospital. I'm just saying. Either, you know, this is committed hospital. <laughs> you know, I'm just saying. I don't know. Um, this is definitely um, a reality check with that Knight of Pentacles. Somebody is about to get a reality check. Um Things are going to change, and I think things are going to change really, really fast. Say, for example, if you are single, you're going to be in a commitment. From single to a commitment. If you um, are in a relationship, there's going to be a breakup. There, there, you know, I'm just saying. I mean, I hate to say that. It's not going to be the case for everybody. Okay, that's not going to be the case. And, and a partnership could be with a business partner. It could be with a friend. It could, you know, that is a separation from a relationship that is not emotionally fulfilling. Somebody's been lying, okay? Somebody may have taken a break from a partnership that was emotionally unfulfilling. You know, they've taken a break. They've been healing. They've been isolating themselves. And boom, here it is. Somebody new. This could, I could go all day with just these cards. Somebody is not looking where they're going. And they are about to run into something. That shakes things up. Put it that way. Good luck.